Milwaukee Bucks going up against the Philadelphia 76ers. Kevin Harlan here, and I'm joined by Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sidelines. Now here's Allen coming off a solid outing against Minnesota. Hits it from three-point range. And Greg, looking at the standings early on in this season, what would you tell teams that have gotten off to a rough start? That it's a marathon and not a sprint. And there's no reason to panic and look to make big changes yet. Plenty of time to come together and right the ship. Here's Red. Pass to Cassell. Thomas feeling it out a bit. Allen outside. Just five to shoot. Milwaukee needs to get off a shot here. Here's Johnson. And he misses his first shot. About one minute into the first quarter. Allen Iverson on the way. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. He's a fantastic facilitator. He could virtually run a team in his sleep. Here's Cassell. He had 15 points last out. Here's the pass to Allen. Here's Red. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. First person. Yeah, and you know, Red is a stealth sniper. I mean, somebody who operates well off of screens and has a quick release as well can get his own shot, too. The Bucs shooting their first free throws of the game. And they were 75% from the line a season ago. First one falls for him. Free throws good from Red. And we're about a minute and a half into the first quarter. Snow the pass to Iverson. His shot is good, making him a perfect two for two from the floor. Pound for pound, I don't know if there's a tougher player than Allen Iverson. Here's Cassell. Pass to Allen. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Johnson with a screen on Snow. Lock at six. And again, the Bucks miss. Boy, he knows he should have knocked that one down, especially with the defense not giving much of an effort. To the inside, Johnson. Second shot opportunity. And there's the bucket. Stay with it on the offensive glass, getting it done. Got to box out on the boards. When you don't, that's what happens. Here's Snow. And the officials calling for a three-second violation. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for Milwaukee. Three-point lead. Pass to Allen. Michael Red on the wing. Uncovered. That one goes. Count it. Red's got seven points in the game. That lefty stroke of him, Red's, man, it might be. Well, it is one of the best in the league. Iverson outside. Hands the shot from the wing. Six points for Iverson. Well, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Allen, that's good. Allen is lights out as a three-point shooter. Love how fast his release is. Staple gun quick. Iverson outside. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in the first quarter. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Bucs. To me, it's been the ball move. That's been the key. I mean, going from good to great. Not settling for a good shot, making that extra pass, keeping the defense off balance, and taking great shots. 
And they've also done a great job turning defense into offense tonight, creating turnovers and capitalizing on the other end. And the first one drops. You can really tell Iverson approaches the game with a single-minded focus. Can be intimidating trying to defend a guy with his level of skill and determination. And both free throws good for Iverson. Bucks leading by four. First quarter of play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. Thomas kicks to Allen. Cassell against Snow. Six on the shot clock. No one near him. And another basket for Milwaukee.